Hello pilots and ground crew, welcome back to my channel again. Well, this is just a follow-up uh, video to that one I did about uh, LQ range for a gentleman called Malcolm. Right, it, just so you can actually see what I was actually talking about, really I should have added something like this to the video, right? My LQ range is on the right hand side, well you can see it quite clearly, it says LQ 2.1. Hundred. Now I mentioned in that video, right? Depending on which TBS Crossfire module you're using, right? When you take off, right? When you're 30, 40, 50 feet away, that number, which is the strongest signal number, right, will drop to one one hundred. But I also mentioned there's nothing wrong with that, right? I'm not going to go over that again. If you didn't see that video, I'll leave a link to it in the description down at the bottom but I just wanted you to see what happens because I've done a kind of a long range it's not miles and miles and miles I think it's about a mile or half a mile or whatever it was I can't remember now but uh, it's just that I wanted you to see when the LQ range drops right to 1 100 it basically stays on that and this is what I was trying to explain in the video previously Right, but I should have shown like a video like I'm doing now. So, anyway, it's a uh, takeoff, it's DVR footage, so it's not brilliant. If you wanted to see the flight in HD, I'll stick it on at the end, but it's not a great flight. I've really only done it as a test, but if you want to see the HD flight, I'll stick it in at the end. Okay then, let's uh, take off. Right, keep an eye on that LQ, that's reading 2100. And it's just dropped, there you go, to 1100, at about 40, 50 feet away from me. The the middle information number, three digit number that's moving is the distance from me, basically, in case you didn't know. But as you can see, I'm blasting away and it's just staying on 1 100. This is what I was trying to explain. Don't panic if it drops to 1 100. Alright, because I'm using the uh, the Tango 2. Alright, so how can I explain this? It isn't as powerful as some of the bigger modules. But I went quite a distance there. I could have easily done a hell of a lot further. But it, I wanted to keep this short because it's just like a follow up. It's just so you could see. But that 1100 on the link quality, the LQ, just doesn't move. It just stays the same. There was a tiny fluctuation there where it dropped, but that's because I was on an angle and just behind them trees for so for a split second. Plus I'm facing as as I'm going down the field now, I'm actually facing to the right. <laughs> but uh yeah, so that's what I meant. So if it drops to one one hundred, there's nothing to worry about. Right, because as you can see, it basically stayed on it, even though I went quite a distance. Right, I'm going to leave that there. If you want to see the HD flight, it's coming up now.